Hey guys, Chris Bassett here, Lincoln Journal Star, day two of our camping series. We're out at Lincoln Southeast, just got done watching a little bit of practice for the Knights on day two here. I really like what I saw from a vibe standpoint, uh, a laid back attitude, but at the same time, you know, very business like. This is a group that's hungry to improve on last year's five and five record, even though that was something that got them into the playoffs. Five and five, you know, in, in the in the long tradition of Lincoln Southeast isn't something they're going to be happy with. They've got some questions to answer, especially up front on both sides of the ball. That's something head coach Ryan Gatula alluded to. They they need some help on the offensive lines. They need some help on the defensive lines as far as building depth. They have a stud in Gunnar Gatula. That's obvious. The coach's son. He's a Husker commit, and, and he looked the part today. He looked really good uh, going through drills. He was out here throwing 50-yard spirals and warm-ups. Just a just a real natural athlete, a guy that, that's going to lead them up front. But what are they going to put around him? I think that's kind of the big question mark. I like what they have at running back with Max Butenbach, returning all city player. I think they've got a couple guys at quarterback, uh, including Owen Baxter, who started the playoff game for, for Lincoln Southeast last year. So they, they've got some pieces there to work with, some questions up front. If they can get that figured out, I think they're going to be in a good spot. Tomorrow we're off to Lincoln Southwest. We'll check in with the Silverhawks. Thanks for tuning in. We'll talk to you soon.